newspaper office. So I've given you that list of goods we need for Mrs. Lawson's. And Jasper, please, just what's on the list. I'm trying to make sure that we don't spend more than $2 this month, so it's important that we just keep to our budget. Oh. All right, then. Jasper, you haven't heard a word I've said. Oh, oh yes, uh, budget, yes, very tight budget. Mr. Harold B. Dunn, the man behind Dunsburg, Pennsylvania, the city of the future, is in Charlottetown. Sources close to the entrepreneur say that Mr. Dunn is looking for the site of his next project. Dunsville? Avonlea is to become Dunsville. Preposterous. Now, now, Rachel Lynn, you don't know what the man's going to say. But you don't have to be a mind reader, Archie Gillis. I couldn't agree with you more, Rachel. Oh, there's a first. No Yankee's going to come up here and buy up all our property. Well, the next thing you know, we'll have an invasion of Americans, that's what. Can't you at least give the man a fair hearing first before manning the ramparts? Are you telling me you're prepared to entertain all this? Candles, milk, eggs, tooth powder, wooden spoon. Come right in, Jasper. Huh? Rawlings Roll Oats is presenting this display. It's a new sales venture, a traveling motion picture show. Oh, my, my, my. Motion pictures are so exciting. Huh? Oh. 